Hey everyone and welcome back to another Roblox Studio tutorial and today I'm going to be teaching you how to make an enemy NPC. This is an example of what you're going to learn today. An NPC that follows you around and tries to kill you. So if you want to learn how to make that, first you're going to go to the toolbox. You're going to get a dummy. Get an all 15 dummy and then you can rename it to what you want your dummy to be called. I'm just going to call mine NPC. And then inside of my NPC, I'm going to add a script. And I'm going to call this script AI script. This is the script we're going to be using for this video. I'm going to leave it down in the description because I know it's kind of long and complicated. Essentially what's happening is when the NPC touches you, you take damage. And this is the amount of damage you take, so you can change that if you want to. And down here is the code that actually tells the NPC to move toward you. And now, a really important part. You're gonna change humanoid name to NPC humanoid. If you don't do this, then the entire thing will break. Next, you're gonna add a script, and you're gonna call this script respawn script. Now here's the respawn script, I'll leave it in the description as well. But essentially what it's doing is making sure that the NPC chases you, no matter if you respawn or not. Then once you've done that, you're gonna add in another script, and you're gonna call this script anim script. This is going to be your animation script. And this is the script you're going to be using today. I'm going to leave it in the description because obviously it's way too long. But once you've imported that, your NPC should be done. But one thing I also like to do is make sure that the NPC is slower than you. So that you actually have time to get away from it. So I'm going to change the walk speed to 8. You can change the walk speed inside of the humanoid. And once you've done that, you can play in the enemy NPC works. And that is how to make an enemy NPC in Roblox Studio. If you enjoyed, Leave a like and subscribe, it really does help me out a lot. And I'll see you in the next video.